seems likely that that's like the idea that you could jump away if you had a bad surge. Yeah, and the surge is it on? Which is kind of interesting. And like that being something to consider about uh, setting up for the flagship fight. Because sometimes like the, the scariest part is the surge. You see the Stealth B is my best ship? Yeah, it's one of them. Look at that. Good old Stealth B. How can you not get 7k with that? How could you not? Possibly a lie. Alright, so what have we done? We've done all the Kestrel ships already. Knocked them out. Fed B, Mantis A, and the Laney ships are all done. Um, I used to use Speed Hack just to speed up games for uh, training, but that's that's been about it. Um, unless I'm doing, like, some overhaul mod thing. Oh, okay. Uh, I guess we can get Unreal on board. That's very easy. Boy. Um... So don't have Crystal Cruiser all unlocked on them. Radiation poison. Hey Faith, how's it going? I remember way back when that um, I think this was before Advanced Edition had came out, and Lethal Frag had spent over a thousand hours and had not unlocked the Crystal A. Play reckless as intended. I don't know if reckless is uh. Um, because I know there are some quality of life mods. Like I said, I used to do the speed hack for training or like, because cloning could take a long time, punching down ships or getting some crew kill stuff. That was like, that's super convenient. Uh, maintain sanity. Um, there's also some ones that like, can like tell you like outcomes of events, which is kind of cool. Angry man. Green with rage. Welcome on board. Guess I wants to be a rock? Uh, maybe. I can put you down for one, though. I wouldn't mind a rock. Rock pilot would be really nice. You know, Crow, how are you? Booms Maniac, hello, hello. 10 plus quest one. Yeah, so... I'm pretty sure, like, the first time I unlocked it, I, I just... I did the Rock Sea and renamed my crew Ruin. So you, all you had to do is get to the Rock Home Worlds and then you would know exactly where the quest marker was. But 1.6 update removed that. While you can use the Rock Sea to find the Rock Home Worlds, renaming the crew Ruin does nothing. 38 to 51 achievements. There's actually, um, I know some players who like, like Dolphin Chemist went 3000 hours without completing all the achievements. Uh, finally, just like one time, decided to sit through and get through them. Uh, I know Farb is missing a couple. I think at least I thought Farb was missing a couple. In terms of like like ship unlocks, though, there oh, there's there's that thing where you sometimes you have to like throw runs. Uh, I just gave them all back to myself when my save got deleted. Mm hmm. Astronomically low odds, that's a fun one. Once I found out that you could, it didn't have to be like in a single volley, and I think I actually did it against the flagship, I breached. No, 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 it was like an auto ship and I breached its uh, like weapons, so it was just this burst laser three and just waited a huge amount of time. Cool, cool. Yeah, I think at one point I went through hard. Like, the hardest one I, I thought and other people could differ was, like, the crew kill one because it, like, wasn't proccing properly where, where you needed to kill with the uh, boarding drone. You needed to kill, like, four. And, like, some people swear that clones count and other people, including myself, say they don't. For an auto ship. Yeah. Yeah, there's definitely, like, runs that get thrown for just achievement hunting. 
Keep asking questions and watch Crow. Yes, watch Crow. What is learning? All right, yeah. Uh, so we got the uh, the Zoltan A. Zoltan A is a pretty powerful ship. It starts with the Halber Beam and Zoltan Shield. And those are two really good like end game pieces. Um, we even have level two doors, which is pretty nice. So the weakness of the ship is, if you hit a really nasty fight, you can be in some bad shape. Um, because your crew can't put out fires and you have this very slow firing halberd. So schools of thought in terms of upgrades, like one shield and the Zoltan shield are going to be really safe for 90% of the fights you get into. So I personally like upgrading weapons and getting the Leto online, as well as getting a buffer point for the halberd beam. Uh, and I do that instead of going for shields too. Um... Yeah, so that's like a strategy, and I push for it more so if I get an early store, because then it's unlikely that I'm going to find a store later in the sector, because it's only like a 1.5. Um, Crow just in the halberd. I'm not just in the halberd. It's slow, though. It is. Um, the others are all thought people just, like, they don't get any upgrades, and they just try to get to um, get a system online, like another weapon or hacking. It's just like those the really gross fights where it's like, well, do I try and Leto and, and live or take my chances with Halberd? I went on for the achievement of uh, being never worked out. I even tried the best ship I had. Yeah, like FTL, FTL has an easy, but it's not. Yeah, Halberd is great when you have hacking and cloaking and systems. A lot of things are really good though with those things but yeah no i mean halberd just can kind of kill ships all right the data you carry is vital to the remaining federation fleet you'll need supplies for the journey so make sure to explore each sector before moving on to the next we get to the exit before the pursuing rebel fleet can catch up all right okay hold on a second there confused to use hacking for 100 time yeah uh i pretty much get hacking on all my ships whoa that's a dead end all right that's why we scout sectors Exit is a nebula. It's not cool. Wow, and we got this split. Okay. Doesn't make me feel particularly confident we're gonna find a store here. Okay, this is fine. Probably. Maybe. Why is switching is like, I don't know, Twitch how Twitch works. I don't think anybody knows how Twitch works, including Twitch. It gets boring using it, plus it starts a little timing with subsequent shots for four shielded ships. Yeah, I, I sort of, like, for, like, anytime I give advice for people, there's always a, an issue where, like, there are things that I'm incredibly comfortable with doing and they may not be. And so, like, that advice just can feel, like, really off. Uh, so we're going to take the swipe through here. The beam drone might stay online because it could have a buffer point, but this should go offline. Excellent. So the solar flare is going to be minimum here. As long as we have one shield bubble up, the solar flare is only going to start two fires, one whole damage. We just hope it's not in the weapons or shields because then things can get really bad. Right, let's see where it is. In piloting. All right, we're gonna turn off oxygen, open up the two doors, try and vent it very quickly to try and save our piloting. Um, we'll actually do this swipe. Hopefully it's only level one shields and that's a kill. Nice. Put it out, 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 put it out. Okay, um, we haven't actually done any training, so I'm totally cool with like swapping them so my FTL just keeps charging here. Why am I turning off the oxygen? Yeah, the reason I'm turning off the oxygen is so it depletes the systems even quicker. Also, I should probably turn it back on then. Yeah, we're good. Uh, yeah, everything in FTL is kind of stressful. Boop. 
jump number two. What do you got? Uh, okay, so we got a chain laser hacking, which the hacking can't do anything yet. And lucky altar. Um, is that a heavy laser? Basic laser. Okay, so I probably want to swipe like this. We should be good. Um, it's going to take... So that's one, two, three at most shields down. Then it's going to be the four. So hopefully our swipe will essentially buy us enough time and take their hacking offline so I don't have to worry about a delayed hack messing with my ship too much. Perfect. I'll get two uh, swipes in before we finish, uh, before they do anything. Yeah, the fact that people can play this game like no pause still like blows my mind. Another swipey swipe, then we're out. All right, 15 scrap. I guess it's up to, I don't have enough for that. Uh, one, two, I kind of want to go nebulas, but nebulas are also kind of spooky for me. Because if we go like, if we get half reactor, we only get three power. Right? No, I guess we are, so that's offline. Oh, because reactor, I guess it's, it just depends because they can just cheat in those things. I don't like it. I do want the extra jumps though. One, two, three, four, five. Kind of want to come back around. Uh, three fuel for two drum parts. I don't think so. I mean, yeah, I would be making money, but I hate running out of fuel. I just absolutely hate running out of fuel. Hi there. Oh, defend the outpost. Great, outpost, guaranteed double rewards here. Uh, this is actually a completely safe fight for us. So that's nice. We're gonna put both Zaltans in our shields, just to be extra certain here. We could do weapons training, actually, if we wanted to. Yeah, we could train piloting and we could train weapons. Welcome to the murder most foul. Enjoy your uh, various emotes. No. Yeah, I do have to do this though. Level two hacking. Fantastic. I guess I could always have like shield hacked and then it would have been bad, but we're fine. We're fine. So by putting, like, every time we put a pair of Zoltans into a room, essentially we lock out the ability of the AI to ion. It's pretty handy. It's something I, I occasionally do forget. Eight bucks and another 18. And what to do? Hey, found your stuff on YouTube and glad I caught your stream. Oh, nice. Well, welcome to the channel. Enjoy your stay. All right, so we have 59 bucks. There is no store. So let's go ahead and do the weapons upgrade. Isn't that fun? <laughs> Post what you like. As long as it falls in line with the chat or the uh, channel rules. That's all. Yeah. Oh, they bypassed. That's fun. Okay. Oh, is it really just two? All right. Depower this. Yeah, two. We can just fight him in the mid bay. All right. Nothing fancy here.
Yeah, you can actually kind of do it with one Zoltan, um, which is something uh, I didn't really pick up till recently. I picked that, I got that from like Hollow. And it's a really cool trick. So like what you can do is you stick a Zoltan essentially outside of the room and then you let the ion hit and then you can get the Zoltan in here and it pushes out the ion damage, kind of, so that you can get your uh, charge back. That can be like really handy. And you can even do that with like if uh, like if you put a buffer point into it. Good night, Ray. Yeah. Power in, power out. Next jump. Probably could have waited for my O2 to go back up higher. But hey, hail them! Hi. Not a safe fight. Uh, okay, that's two, three, four damage to Sultan Shields. It's gonna take two volleys. Curious. What kind of crew do they have? Oh no, my shield bubble, it's fine. Zoltan and a Mantis. One, two, three, four, five, six. Uh, I kind of think a crew kill would be really greedy here. Almost. Plus there's no guarantee that this is weapon comes offline anyways. Okay, we swipe through the weapons. Nice, we got the danger weapon offline. That's always good. Always want to be attacking weapons, get them offline. I mean, unless you're doing like crew kill shenanigans. Get so the enemy can't hurt you. Uh, that's a pretty terrible offer. They're not things that I really need. I want more money. I want more money. Another thing you can do is because we have this weapon, you can bring it online if you're concerned about like getting ioned in the weapons and it gives you a buffer point against that too. Played recently. Oh yeah, yeah. Um, I'm constantly learning. Uh, and, like, pushing myself to get better in certain areas. So, ideally, we won't spend any more money on our ship until we get to a store. Ideally. Uh, we're totally fending for ourselves. It's actually possible, like, this option, sometimes you can get more money in it, out of it, but no fight. But there is a possibility they just take 15 scrap, and then they, uh the rebels still attack you. So it's like, oh, you can lose 15 scrap and get absolutely nothing for it, so no thank you. Now, like, I don't believe in cheeky swipes, um, but there are there's actually this really interesting mechanic or, and or bug where you can do a beam weapon like this between the rooms. And if you do it correctly, the beam actually can double proc. Like, it'll hit the same room twice. Uh, we'll do it this way. Uh, there's only three crew on this ship anyways. And there's a possibility we'll do two damage to the weapon system this way and get the danger weapon offline. Yeah, because we're super moral. There we go. Any like no training, which is kind of all right because we really don't want his ultimate as our pilot. 16 scrap. Cora Sigma! Hello, hello! Actually, we can get unlucky on board. That's a really good name for a Zultan. It's not like they just randomly explode and die for no reason. help no good uh now i i very seldomly will be actually like doing the piloting upgrade for like ion storms um i like chasing blue options i think is generally bad
Do you think completely new players would avoid or come to Nebula? Um, I think a lot. Again, it's going to kind of depend on the player or like what you mean by new player. Because like I watched Lethal Frag play quite a bit before I started. Um, I'd assume most of them kind of just like avoid Nebulas uh, because they really don't like playing without sensors. Versus making really specific conscious decisions of like where nebulas outside of unch like nebula sectors aren't going to have stores. Uh, get to the station. All right. Oh, this is easy fight. All right, GGs. Oh, we were talking earlier about training ships. Um, so what that is is you, is you find a ship that can't hurt you essentially. Um, and then you just sit there and farm dodging experience. Uh, weapons experience can be possibility, those kinds of things. All right, got a breach missile. Okay, that's cool. It's worth money. We're up to 85 scrap, plus a breach missile, it's solid. Plus we already spent 35. Super shield bypass, but they brought money with them. Neat. Uh, they're in my sensors. Right, so some, so they put probably two in my sensors, and there's two, so there's a total of four. All right, with that off, I don't know if they'll be able to break the sensors or not. Might be close. Yeah, come on in. Don't break my doors. Really? It was just the one? That's interesting. All right, let's go ahead and bring up back the oxygen. Now, this is, like, totally a viable strategy against borders when you're not in a firefight. Essentially, like, venting all the ship and forcing them into your med bay. Uh, if you are in a firefight, though, this is often not the best way to do it. You're gonna have to, like, be, like, way more careful and precise. Choi is a strong word. I prefer masochistic, but sure. Um, yeah, I don't know. It, I don't think if I was, like, into the breach, I kind of, like I said, I, I've said it a couple times where, like, I figured out most of the stuff that you have to do in that game, and I was just like, all right, like, that's it. There's not, there's not really another level of knowledge that I really need. But FTL, there always seems to be, like I said, something new I can pick up, something I can improve upon. Interesting. <sighs> I'm not gonna dive. We're not diving. Hi there, forward scout for the rebels. Oh, they're trying to run away. All right, this should be no problem. No problem. I was totally willing to use the Leto here. So we're gonna hit a nut. There's, there's again, this is only three crew on this ship. Um, we're gonna hit five systems, so they're gonna have to stop flying the ship to go and do repairs. Aw, oh, Speed Lunky is such a thing. Uh, they could have a repair bot, they could just have an anti-personnel bot, or what they could have is like an ion, um, or like boarding bot, and because we have Zoltan Shield, they can't get on board right now. We also could have seen if the doors opened. Thirteen scrap. All right, so this is like a pretty typical Zoltan A run where you're just like slicing through enemy ships. Um, there's very little interactivity heat going on here.
Uh, looks like we can get one, one jump. Oh, wow, a store? Really? Okay, yeah, that seems good. Store seems perfect place for a store. Uh, backup battery. Oh, the store is garbage. Why? Okay. Probably take backup battery to thin out the pool. I'm not. Breach is really bad. Boarding also isn't a particularly tempting option here. Yeah, no immediate hacking. That's all right. We'll take the battery. Uh, fuel, I think we're fine on. Other consumables are okay. We're not buying any crew here. Battery's nice on Zoltan. It's definitely one of those things like I, I learned to appreciate more. I mean, for the longest of time, I was just like, I mean, I could just spend 40 scrap and have two solid power bars or like 50 scrap. That's what I want more so. But a lot of it really is actually just the idea that I want it out of the pool. So when I find systems in stores, I'm more likely to find the ones that I want. All right, I'm going to call that a pretty good sector one. What are my options? Uncharted or Zoltan controlled? Yeesh. <sighs> so, Uncharted Nebulas are really gross. They're like the worst sectors in the game in terms of making money. They're only like one and a half stores. Um, some of the lowest scrap gains, like in particular without having long range scanners. It's y yucky. Um, Sultan sectors can also be kind of bad for us. Because it's going to take us uh, a couple swipes with our halber beam to be able to hurt them. But there are two stores. And this is also an uncharted nebula, because slug sectors don't show up until sector four. So do I take a garbage nebula and not deal with Sultan ships to go into double green? Or do I get two stores now? And probably then go to here. I mean, worst case scenario is I could just buy second shields. Like, what does that look like? We could even do just a shields buffer if that was becoming a concern. We do already have the Leto online. I'm gonna go ahead and go Zoltan. I don't love it, love it, but we'll take our chances. Well, a lot of nebulas. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. The only problem with nebula is that they're not stores. Hi. Yeah, highly enlightened. That's what I heard. All right, what kind of missile are you? Let's find out. I'm just going to battery to keep my oxygen online. I mean, we could actually depower the shield and do it the same way, and that's actually would be correct. Oh, good dodge. Love a good dodge. All right, so Halber Beam is going to do four damage to the Zoltan shield. Oh, I did that lazily. Uh, what we should have done is, like, started the beam here and just got the tip into weapons, and then it actually would have damaged the weapons for us. Um, all right, so this fires. This is three damage to the next volley, and then I'll absorb another shot, which this will fire first, so the Zultan Shield will absorb that. Uh, so we should be able to sneak our halberd in. We'll play it safe. Or not. Fire first, fire first. A good dodge. So he started in the shields, hopefully taking the shields offline so we get the two damage in the room. I gotta remember to do the proper swipes there. Bum, bum, bum. Sixteen. All right, that's not a store. If that's a store, then I just don't get to see it. 
do I want to do the... I still don't want to do the piloting upgrade. It's not like I'm going to run into five drone control. Five power drone control. Let's just keep riding. Let's see. Yep, GG's. Good fight. So the reason being, like, if I spend 20 scrap and I never get the event, like, it's 20 scrap that I might have gotten towards, like, saying, getting cloaking, another weapon, getting an upgrade to my weapons. And those things are, like, more important. Um, but we are running pretty far ahead in terms of overall scrap. And we do have, like, a lot of nebula jumps. does make it more tempting. All right, one, two, three, four, five. Six, probably six jumps before they get here. One, two, three, four, five. We'll probably be able to get there. Five. As much as I love making money, like I really gotta prioritize finding stores to buy systems and or weapons. Craft, you have weapons, I have weapons. What kind of drone do you have? Okay. Should only be a Leto. Try to kind of make this fight safe. Nice. Okay, they did have a buffer point. That's whatever. It's gonna take him like 36 seconds to go ahead and fix this, so we have some time. It is possible this to damage through, but again, with the buffer point here, there's not like really concern that our weapons will come down. Maybe I have to hit the weapons and start a double fire for it to be an issue. And blaster flak. Yeah, I'd be, I'd be okay with the flak. 17 bucks. So yeah, we take this beacon in case that is a store. Pirates, and they have a Sultan. Fun. Uh, all right, yeah, this fight is uh, very gross. So this is a Leto. The Leto's gonna fire in time. So yeah, that's a Leto because these types, of, these ship types, if they have drone control, they don't have an Artemis in the first two sectors. Um, these types of ships actually only are allowed to have two powered weapon systems. And so that's one power. There's the other one. One, two, three, four. Uh, it'll be close. What we might do, can I stretch it? Okay. Okay, we'll do this first. Okay, we missed, that's unfortunate. All right, so we got through the gross part. Let's go ahead and power this up. play it safe so my plan was honestly was like to actually fire a missile into here in case they had the buffer point and then just like one swipe them didn't turn out to happen that way hit my shields it's interesting that this went offline versus this I mean I, I'll take it it's definitely better for me that that was the result 
All right, since we're not in danger, I don't want them to press and actually get that online, so we'll actually send them both to do repairs. Now we are floating in enough power that we don't worry about this getting depowered. It doesn't feel like it's worth trying to fire another missile here. No. Uh, if they're running away, maybe it will. Uh, it's going into piloting. With a fire. All right, so we're just going to vent that out. <laughs> Particularly a double fire. Um, I guess... I mean, I'm gonna get hit here. Okay, a bit of a concern of, of like, it hitting in this room or that room, starting multiple fires and things just getting gross. There's also the possibility it was safe, but. Not a store. Oh, wow. Could be. One. So we take this beacon to see if those two are stores. Um. Again, I don't think there's anything I want to do to my ship. I don't actually know if, like, asteroid fields can happen in Zoltan sectors or not. Hi there. Okay. Kind of gross. High potential of being very gross. Okay, it's a really good start. All right, so that should hit the weapons for us, ideally. There we go. Yeah, so that's what I should have done in that other fight I was talking about. So the halberd beam, like I said, it does its... All beam weapons essentially do, like, their base damage times two to Zoltan shields. And then once the Zoltan shield is done, there's still, like, a little bit of the beam to go. So if you just put, like, just, like, the end of it into a room through the single shield, you can uh, have that result. Oh, nice. They uh, unpowered their weapon. It's convenient. Now we're going to get mind control here. It's a uh, level one mind control. All right. Okay. So what we can do here, actually is we're gonna get their... Oh, what's the way to do the most damage? We're gonna depower this by actually sending the Zoltan through the room to do repairs. And I guess we could just do this, that's fine. Get our crewmate back before they uh, do any damage to our systems. Or more importantly, to our hull. That's fun. Uh, okay, still no store yet. One, two, three. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Uh, this is such a bad sector layout. Hopefully that's the store. If not, we kind of get forced to burn some jumps. Oh, we're completely safe in this fight. That's always cool. 
Out of curiosity, what kind of crew do they have on their ship? Zoltan in Iraq. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. It'd be close. I don't even know if they have level one oxygen. If they had a Mantis crew member, we actually would have like a decent chance of getting like, well, if they had a Mantis, we could get a crew kill here. Yeah, that's the thing, is that it does charge slower. So if it was a Mantis, I have a shot, but against the Zoltan, I mean, if I did like a three room swipe, and it's not like I can do, um, whatever, bio swipes here. No, heck, it's level two. All right, GG's, you got me. No crew kill. And they're probably gonna run anyways. Lots of fun. Lots of fun in FTL. Be a store, be a store. Wow, that's both stores. Or that could have been a store. I uh, we didn't get there in time. All right, so that's one jump, two, three, four, five, one, two. Okay, let's. Cruel mistress, yeah. Like, we went to this sector specifically because it had two stores, and yeah. Like, I, if, if there's both stores here, I actually still want to visit both of them. Most likely. All right. Okay, so here's the jump. Then we got a nebula jump. Then we have another nebula jump. Then we have a regular jump, a regular jump, a nebula jump, and then another nebula jump. So, one, okay. I'm just trying to see if I can pick up this jump and not hose myself. Okay, so this, nebula jump, regular jump. Nebula, nebula, regular, regular, nebula, nebula. I don't think so. Hi oh, how you doing? It's funny, this is actually what speed racers or speedrunners of the game do. Because they want that missile to like hit shields and like solo swipe enemies. Um I'm always curious. Maybe I shouldn't be. Oh, it's double Zoltan. That's interesting. Uh, yep. Wow, that got insta-fixed? Unfortunate timing. Uh, it's okay, we have one, two, three, so we still get one more swipe in here as long as I don't accidentally depower anything. Hey, we're 
Ribster. Oh, I'm doing all right. You know, I'm hanging in there. Hanging in there. We did, uh, what did we do? I don't know if you, we did like a whole playthrough. First time I played through, um, Fallout New Vegas. Had a time. If we don't find anything good at the store, this will be fun. Yeah, if we don't find anything good at the store, things will get really gross. Or as you say, fun. Oh, okay, well, we, we can't get hurt this fight. That's always nice. So, uh, in the upcoming sector, Sector 3, we're gonna start seeing two shielded ships. And, uh, if we haven't been able to get, like, a weapon online, things can get very bad for us. Because uh, the halberd beam doesn't do anything, and we're essentially stuck using the Leto to try and set up our, uh, halberd beam. That is not ideal. Ion drone run incoming. Like, there's little you can do to control it. There's some things you can do with, like, mind control. 16. Right. Come on, don't do it. Don't do it, game. Have a heart. Okay, they can uh, one-shot our Zoltan shield. We might use a Leto here. Oh, they got the miss in. Okay, no, we're fine. Cool. Good dodges. We've actually been dodging pretty well, considering. So yeah, the reason I really wanted this sector is because is it's because of the stores. Like I could run from some fights potentially if I had to like make those upgrades or whatever. But it was I didn't want to fall off damage wise. Yeah, solo store. One, two, three, four, five. We'll see. Okay. They won't have a repair bot. Of course they got an NG. Of course they have an NG. Why wouldn't they? No crew kill for us. You should get an NG? All right, again, it's not that I hate NGs because I definitely don't. Not the biggest priority. or a weapon, please. Projectile weapon. Okay. The store decided to be good. Uh, crisis averted. Boring run incoming. Hey, Badger. <laughs> okay. Um, all right, we're definitely buying hacking. <sighs> These are both like three power. 
Uh, we just got to sector at the end of sector two. Uh, the other store in the sector was buried back here, so I didn't get to go to that one. And in sector one, the store didn't have weapons and their systems were battery teleporter and I forget the other one it wasn't hacking <sighs> I have $62 left over So if I get two upgrades, we could pick up the charge two by selling this. You'd get cloaking. <sighs> All right. Okay, so there's two schools of thought here. One is like that we can just between cloaking and hacking with our halberd beam, uh, that's gonna be enough to kill most ships and we'll be like, fine. And then the other is that I get a weapon online so that I have a weapon online. Um, though it is a very heavy investment. And we have two green sectors upcoming. So my problem is, is okay. If we get to, if we go against a Zaltan sector, what are we gonna do? I guess we can cloak their volley. Yeah, it, the problem is that it's three. There are threes for twos. I mean, I still have the Leto. In some ways, this is actually the more tempting option as far as weapons go. Yeah, I, I'm just trying to think of... Plus, I'm going to be behind on getting the second shield online, but that could be fine. If we were 100% in on a weapon. All right, cloaking drops me to 37. I guess we could just keep the charge booster unless I wanted to sell it for 25. We also have to upgrade hacking though, right? Like that's the other thing is I have to upgrade hacking. I mean, I still can. Got battery. Yeah. And I still have Leto. All right. Okay, I'm just doing it now because I, I, I have to do it. Like, I have to do it. We're pretty solid defensively. If I didn't have a Zoltan shield, I think I'd, I'd almost be more inclined to go with the weapons. I don't know. So we need hacking two to consistently take down two shield bubbles. Elsewise, it's a coin toss with level one. Technically, it's a coin toss. It's actually based on like a specific frame that you start the hack. Yeah, plus now you just get to blame Badger. All right, let's go. NG or Uncharted? Oh, right, right. I went to here because this was the uh, double split. All right, yeah, NGs. That's fine. Okay. Exit beacon. Don't need a store, but you want to know how many stores we could run into. Hi there. Scavenger of the remains of an engine carrier. They turn and fight. Uh huh. Guess what we're gonna hack? Shields. 
Yeah, see, they can even have buffer points. I think that's kind of gross. So Arletto actually wouldn't do anything here because the engine would just go and fix it before we could fire again. It's kind of silly. Uh, zip. on you. I should probably buy a reactor. Because I really... I can't move around Zoltans like I can normal other power for depowering shenanigans. I have to remember that. Okay, can we really just getting money right now? Oh, we're so good against hacking. Uh, no, thank you. Store, no, thank you. Oh, we don't have to do this. Uh, what kind of crew do they have on their ship? Oh, that's tempting. Hmm. All right, so the basic laser fires at 10, this fires at 11, but then there's travel time. Potential crew kill. Yeah, that would be correct. Um, but I'm sort of tempted in just getting the mantis to board us. Cause that's just gonna happen first. do this the most awkward way possible. That's all we needed to have happen. Go away, Ryan. I don't know where the timing is. station down there. Yeah, okay. Um 
I have a plan. It's potentially dangerous here, but we got plenty of stuff. Okay, now the NG's gonna board us. Yeah, I wasn't 100% certain. I had lost track. Uh, now the question is, is where is the... Um room is the mantis in. Okay. Uh, we're fine. Oh, there you are. Hi. Cool. 27 scrap. Hey, three all repaired. That's, that's great. That's definitely what I was looking for. I lost track. Shh. Ships are so good for crew kills. They're just super good for crew kills. <sighs> okay, that goes out. What? No, I don't know what you're talking about. Shh. Cool. Oh, do I have to run through the exit? Unless I go this way. One, two, three. I don't think I can get there in four. I can get there in three. One, two. Oh, no, that connects up to here. All right, that's fine. All right, low on fuel. I don't think I bought some in at the store. Um, oh, I have cloaking. Okay. Ha. Huh. Interesting. Are we buying drone control? Maybe. Oh, heck no. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. No. Shot. Mmm, true. Wait, what? No, oh, it was shield hack, yeah. I just read that like Artemis all the way, and I was just like, nope. Nothing useful. Uh, okay. I really would like fuel. It was actually an Artemis. I'm honestly thinking of hitting the store just to hit whatever store is here and back here, just to keep that beacon as a possible. One, two, three, four. Uh, if that's the store, I can't. No, no, I've been to that beacon. Yeah. 
One, two, three, four. There's the dive. I want the fuel. Boo. What? Hey, Galaria. So that wasn't a store, that wasn't the store. So it had to be that one and that one. That's not good. And there was no uh, additional store generated. Ah. Uh. That's okay. Maybe we'll get it from a fight. Um, okay. All right. So we do have the FTL recharge booster, so that's very helpful. We still have stuff we can sell if we do hit a store. And those are like some cheap improvements that I could do to hopefully increase my overall survivability if I dive or run into something disgusting. I don't think I'm gonna dive. Yeah, distress could just be people asking for fuel, or it could be a guaranteed event. Also an Artemis. Okay, taking the Artemis offline right off the bat is good. Level three oxygen. <sighs> okay, so. That's so ridiculous. Well, I was just going to get like an O2 repair shenanigan, but, but, uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay. I mean, it could also be like, hey, if you have a bean, cut them out safely, and you're good to go. Just wait for the oxygen to come back online. Those are defeatist words. Yep. Also, like, all the one-shielded ships... Interesting. Okay, I got one jump into the next sector. That's it. That's all I got. Zolt and Homeworlds are rock controlled. I don't like either of those. Has options. So we take this jump here to buy us the most amount of time for the fleet pursuit to catch up to us. I feel like I have to buy a buffer point in my shield system now. Like I just can't 
be like that neglectful. That's so gross running out of fuel. Uh, now I have to attack the slaver scum. They're gonna be running. All the ships are gonna be running that we face. Okay, so this is all right. As long as we never screw up. It's really important that we don't screw up. Nope. I love the human, but uh, I have to try and get fuel from this event. Or from this beacon. Two fuel. Okay, still alive. Um, that does show me two beacons that I haven't seen. That shows me two beacons I haven't seen. I guess I take that one. Doesn't really matter. Well, those kind of repeat. Okay. Okay, we have plenty of things to sell if we do find a store. Okay, asteroid field. Uh-huh. Flak 2, uh-huh. <sighs> so we beam through here, Halberd plus Leto does force the Flak 2 offline. Currently, it's fine. Okay. Um, acceptable. Battery's still up. Tears still charging. Uh, do I fire a missile into their shields just to make sure Halberd's good here? Oxygen back online. Well, the uh, the the concern here is because it's rock ship, and I get stupid. You know, hey, asteroid stopped showing up, and it got, like, a double resist, and it's still alive. And I have 25 missiles. Nope, no fuel. Hey, two fuel. Really glad that I got the, uh, the second shield, though. One, two, three. Yeah, I got clothing for the flak shots. It's all fine. It's fine. We have the systems. I can't remember how much fuel I had when I left that store. If it was something where I only had 10. I kind of want to check to see if that's a store, but then that does give me like a lot of repeated jumps. Hey, not that one guy. GG's on getting through uh, hardcore mode in uh, Resident Evil 3 Remake. Hey, Silver. Yeah, well, I could have sold the, um, the FTL charge booster. Into another asteroid field. Into intruders on my ship. Okay, we're essentially going to be doing the exact same thing we just did. Uh, that's gross. 
Yeah, except this fight is worse. Because <sighs> I'm going to lose piloting very quickly. Um, and I have to win this fight. Because they're going directly into my piloting, I don't have the chance of just like, hey, hack their weapons, do hack cloaking, and get out of it. My FTL is not going to be charging. Gosh, I almost want to just yellow and then come back again with it. Okay, both of those hit. I'm holding them out for a little bit here. And all right, um, wow, level three piloting. Oh, that's so gross. Come on, okay. All right, the weapons going down is very, very helpful. Okay, I'm switching to real power over here. Yeah, so it caused a breach and then caused a fire. That's a really good uh, leto. Possible crew kill here. And sadly, that's that's bold. We'll s I I kind of doubt it, but I don't know. Maybe it's this is like a really really spooky fight. Um, they don't have like a lot of haul. I have no idea how much crew they have. <laughs> Yes. No, you're gross. You're so gross, FTL. You're so mean. I can't turn down three fuel. Like, any time I lose a jump is way worse than taking, like, a low-end offer. Like, if I miss a jump because I'm out of fuel, that's so much worse than, you know, just taking an offer there. You can't, right. You can't be wrong, but you could. All right, I'm going to wait for my oxygen to get all the way back up. And the other thing is, I don't have to worry about the mine event because I do have a Leto, so uh, my crew will be safe. A 
Almost. Uh, this is the thing we cloak. Even though that actually deals four damage. It has been slightly scratched, though. Poor Leto. Um, actually, now I am set up that that could dunk me. That's fun. Yeah, there it is. Let's just take all their weapons offline, shall we? Let's shall. Well, here it's like, it's not asked to do a whole lot and it gets set up by the powerful combination of halberd beam and hacking. But it still has, like, value of, you know, like, clipping some systems for us. Two fuel. All right. Okay, we we'll just keep getting fuel here. Good. All right, I know that's not a store. That could be. So we take the distress. Oh, good. Dead end jumps. The best. I love you, FDL. You're the greatest. Sure. Hey, found two fuel. One, two. One, two, three, four, five, six. There's more than six jumps in this sector. All right. I found a store. We have seven fuel. You can slow down a little bit here. What's wrong? Demand they pay it. Ah, oh, we no free damage again. Rude, rude. Uh, so this is cool. We just need to do two damage to their weapon system, and this missile comes offline, and then we're completely safe. Greasy Halbert wins every fight in the run. Uh, how many people? So there's one crew in engines, there's one in here. So the engines would have to try and fix the O2. Oh, I think this is probably very silly to try. The crew buys react. Oh no, from the event. Sometimes they just give us a, a react free reactor. They might give us a discounted one. I don't know if that slows them down enough. The double door breaking. Also, there's just like the possibility of the missile fires, and then I'm sad. Seventeen. Hey, see, free reactor. Free reactor. Continue. One, two, three. Uh, I guess I take this one now. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. So I can actually pick up the store and then just take everything else. All right, we'll see. I've been pre-igniter. Explosive replicator, mind control teleporter, no weapons. All right, I think we get rid of that. 
And then I think we buy all that. And then we see if there's enough in. Okay, so we don't actually get to see the second store in this sector because it's buried. Cool. Love it. Uh, that's all junk. Okay, we only got one system left. I mean, I guess we're going mind control. Yeah, rocks are two stores. Pretty sure. Pretty sure that's what I have on my sheet. It's definitely never wrong. Yep, two. Alright, not finding another damaging weapon, though, is pretty bad. Because it starts becoming really hard to, like, damage weapons on enemy ships to points where we're actually safe. Do I keep this? Albert does it all. Uh-huh. I guess. Like, this doesn't really help me in terms of, like, hitting weapons uh, we have. We're just going to run the systems that we have. So, you're done. You're done. Yeah, I mean, with drone recovery arm, uh, value. I mean, it's dumb. Like, this is, like, everything we need to win the run except for weapons. Crow, challenge run. Beat the game with only the starting weapons on the Zoltan A. I don't like chat. No. No. Let's not do that. <sighs> That's kind of tempting. Get a fully trained pilot. Just move the Zolt into shields. Get a reactor upgrade for... It's only cost me 20 bucks. I got mind control. That's That, that helps deal with the boarding situation. Right? Right, Crow. Exactly. Just to be certain, we'll get that up to level two. That's actually cheaper than just buying another crew member. Well, if I do this, then I get the reactor, this, and the blue options so that we can just run the Zoltan up there because we're not going to need the shield charging in the early going. And so essentially, it would be like 45 scrap. So, just 10 bucks. How much is this gonna upgrade? Ugh. If you find a weapon, then I can't do anything else, though. Uh, it's a cute idea, but I can't. I can do this, just so I don't have to move crew around. Don't ask for fuel. So infuriating. Um, hmm. I don't have guaranteed dodge. Okay. Value. Value.
Is that too much? No. I think the plan was that this was gonna hit. Now it's not! Okay, that's fine. It's kind of not fine, actually. fine. Actually, the Zoltan... Like, if we put a Zoltan here, like, the amount of power they could steal essentially probably would have been actually the correct play. Eh, unless I had to find a weapon. Unless I have to find a weapon. Well, never mind. We did it. It's okay. It's all fixed now. Um, who have I got on board? Unreal, unlucky, and angry. Gastro wants to be a rock, Faith and NG, and I two people who want to be uh Mantis. Right? Yep. Okay. Good. Good. Don't do it. Don't ask for fuel. Don't be a jerk. Uh, you find a colony recently loaned an iron. Take him home near my, uh, join our crew. Hey, it's Charlie. It's the best. All right, cool. Probably this will be sufficient, actually. And I believe Gestro wished to be a rock. Never mind, we got the both best of both worlds. We got a totally movable Sultan and we got a rock. It's all good. It's great. Now all we need is fuel and a weapon. What is your specialty? You upgrade my sensors for 37 bucks. Get out of here. <sighs> rock or NG? Uh, we're going to NG because two and a half stores. Maybe this time we'll actually find two stores. One, two, one, two. So we're doing, I think we're going one and two. If that's the store, too bad for us. Uh, might as well get at least up to level three engines. I was actually tempted to get this upgraded and just get a reactor. It's not like I have a lot of money to spend. I mean, I just want to buy fuel. Like I'm going to a store to try and find hopefully more than three fuel at a store. Yes. Nice weapons, by the way. Okay. They're gonna ask for fuel, aren't they? Two, three, four, five, six. What are these sector layouts, though? Serially. At least it's a refuel. Yep. All right, that's also not a store. Sh 
Sure. Hey, we did it. All right. We are 29 hull. It's totally worth the risk of damage there. Yeah. Okay, one, two, three. All right, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven is the plan. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, it's close. Beam them. Uh, there might be. But we're not going to be able to, like, see all the beacons. Like, I'm not... That beacon's almost impossible for me to see. Ooh, wait, 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 wait. Okay, so one, two... Three, four, five... One, two, three, four, five, six. One jump. One, two, three, four, five, six. Two jumps. I just need us that one, two, three. Yeah. Did I run out of fuel before I get there? I walked into their trap. Oh, they got a DD2. Cool. I can't even see it. Like, I can't see the drone. It's completely off the screen. Like, I didn't even... Like, I couldn't even see that it was rotating to target uh, my drone. Uh, we'll try. That's four drones. They may have another drone. All right. One... Boarding drone? So this is a seven power drone system? It's kind of gross. Kind of is. I mean, we're safe. actually kind of acceptable. Also, yeah, that is... Okay, the halberd beam's still out online. Okay, 
Um, okay, Howard Beam's now back online. I got time. Okay. Of course, you're gonna board again. We're fine. Uh, I got plenty of buffers there. Probably can just ignore it and win the fight. It's gonna be the plan. to stop this from charging. Oh no, they they have too much health. Um no, okay, it's okay. They have, like they have enough health. That's so disgusting. Yeah, it's Halberd, so I can hit this and this and okay, but Oh no, Halberd's times two, right? Halberd's times two. Duh. Yeah, it's good, good. Oof, super focused on a lot of other things right then. Yes, it's okay, it's okay. It's all right. There was a lot happening there. Well, I was still gonna start it in piloting anyways. So even if I screwed up, I wouldn't have. Badger lives another day. What was the other option? Oh yeah, I know, the, the one weapon, yeah. Not the crew kill. The Okay, I have $155. Okay. I still don't have uh, my pilot loss training, so I don't have that, but... Storage cache? Like a weapon storage cache? Wow, that's kind of gross. Kind of let o. Two shots incoming. Uh, probably should cloak this. It's three. Like, that'll technically be more, but... Firebomb. Nice! All right, excellent. Firebomb deals no damage. The Ion Bomb here, however, will. Will deal a considerable amount of damage. Go fix. That's good targeting. Okay, yeah. Oh, that's so good. Mostly the thing where we get fuel, so we... Super good. All right, 
One, two, three. How are we still feeling about that? One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three. Okay. And then that's one, two, three. Well, that four is spooky. Yeah, this is 100% three jumps. One, two, three. Yeah, okay. All right, all right. Um, I guess that makes sense. Four drones? I think they can. Tail is surprisingly okay with such things. Okay, uh, but we're gonna do this. That. Hello? That? Remember that as part of this? I do. I still have to keep taking junk rewards just so I can maintain fuel. Yeah, because I actually don't know. Um, our routing doesn't have us going across another store. So, yep. Yep. Groovy. If there's a store over here. I'm totally diving for fuel, though. Uh, take your surrender. Okay, we're back up to 10 fuel, though. Hey. Hey. Yeah, that's true. We don't really need actual scrap. <sighs> Stealth weapons. Ion blast is interesting. Stealth weapons is also interesting. Hacking stun? Um, I don't think so. I mean, it, it's actually worth slightly contemplating as the idea is like, it's going to slow down some things, but because we're, we're probably not gonna be able to do crew kills with our setup very often. But it's nice as now, like we have a good chance that we're gonna be like taking down two weapons and that's gonna make fights a lot safer for us. So that's that's a pretty big improvement. So that's going to give us my 100% dodge. That's good, that's good, that's good. That's so expensive. All right. This is just to make sure that we have 100% dodge for the uh, ASB. Most likely doing a weapons hack here. Uh, technically we don't have to, but we still, yeah, we do. Now there's like no purpose of doing that whatsoever. Bum, 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 bum. 
The reason I'm not getting this online right now is it's a limited benefit. Wait, why is it only 97? Oh, you didn't fully train. Okay, right, right, right. I would like to find another weapon. I think it's reasonable to want to find another weapon. Think of the crystal sector? Yeah, the one we can't go to. Uh, I definitely was thinking about that. Now I can't get to it. Zip, zip, zip. Uh-huh, yeah. No, we're just going through the sector very quickly here. It's okay, it's all good. No fights, just keep on keeping on. Okay, that's actually kind of cool. Basically, yeah, fuel. <sighs> See if that's a store. Okay, that's definitely gonna be the other store. Yeah, sector six, get that jump. So we'll get Faith on board. Um, this is just actually, this is blue options chasing, plus giving me just another crew that can actually put out fires. Hacking stun. All right, we're just gonna go to a mode only mode for a while. Good luck trying to figure out hacking stun in that. So we can go one, two. I don't actually mind diving in this sector, so if we pick up the exit early, it's cool. Participate in their study. Hey, oop. This uh, can potentially enable crew kills. Zoltan uncensors. I know, it's sad. Nobody likes to see it. This is peak crew performance, right? That's, that's the meme. Did I meme right, chat? Did I do it good? Chat is beside itself. Get a firebomb I don't care about. Uh, that's probably worth cloaking. I don't got any mantis doing the job. They decided not to show up. Yeah. And there was really no reason to sell it at the store. And it might get us crew kills in phase one. But I still might want the let out. Keep back. Pro double hull repair drones. For the double repairs. Yep. They buried uh, at like half the stores. Unbelievable. Oh, hi there. Hi.
You know, just use on strike. Selling the DRA. Oh yeah, I forgot. They're like super fans of it. Reloader is cool. Well, I already upset Thomas, so I might as well get DSR on my side. Yeah, it's mostly just for phase three, which it doesn't really matter. Like, we're in such a better position now. But that's a good point. It, it It's of, like, minor assistance. Like, yeah, it can help in certain fights. If I move my crew, if the room gets hacked, it's not, like, a big deal. You could have just got that. Alright. We have kind of end game weapons now. It's all good. I guess we can dock. I do have level two doors. I do. And the missile weapon is this thing that tells me we're not allowed to have any fun here. Um, bum, ba, da, bum. I'll take two weapons offline. Three. Okay, so we do this halberd through here. Three damage, there's no guarantee that comes offline. I kinda want the eh, yeah, we do this anyways. We do that, we do that. We do this. Ha 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 ha, they powered it? That's funny. Okay. I'll take it. Oh my gosh, not having to take fuel surrender offers? I still don't have like a one shot build. I'll need another beam for that. Oh, okay. Yeah, cool. All right, right. I'm gonna need you to calm down here for a, a second here, FTL. Just a, just a smidge. I'm just trying to give my pilot some chances to dodge. Uh, those are the swipes I want. Yes. Oh, okay. That was good. Steal him. Oh, two free damage, yes. Oh, look at the, look at Faith. Faith's like, I got this. Boom, done. Here we go, so far for damage, this is true. T-Roo. 
All right, nine plus eight. I've got 19. Yeah, it's still not quite a one shot. Not there, it's close. Um, okay, well. One, two, three. Surrender. Oh, I guess I could have got there. Got double distresses. They probably want my fuel. Precious, precious. Vital flute. Uh, beam weapon. Sure. Yep. Yeah, let's not actually do anything. Cool. All right. Um. Right? Yes. Gonna try to kill them. Uh, probably not gonna try to kill them. Three. Eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen. I do twelve. Thirteen, fourteen. So I don't have a one shot on this ship. So we're gonna do the really boring thing and just hack their weapons. Everybody's disappointed. Dodge training. It's fires next. Is it this or the missile? Yeah, okay, we're just leaving. Ah, rebels. <laughs> you, okay. Anyone who want to take bets where the store is located? Don't even need a store, but... Hi there. No. The repair damage? What kind of malarkey is that? Asteroid field? Gross. Awesome. Okay. That was very cool that that happened.
All right, so that's gonna do three damage. I can do four, five, which should force that to come offline, so that seems good. That missed. Ah, just close for our shields to recover. Oh, wow, two for two. Good job, asteroids. All right, we got level one piloting now. Zajaru? Hello, hello. What's the secret to sneaking hack passing to defense drone? Oh, okay. Um, Turning it on and off. Actually, turning it off and on. So the defense drone is trying to predict... I'm waiting for the O2 to get back up anyway. So the, the defense drone is trying to predict the pathway of the uh, hack. So it actually shoots ahead of it. So if... And pause makes this a lot easier, in my opinion. Uh, when it fires, like you hear the sound of it firing, you just completely depower hacking. And the shot essentially sails past it, unless it's like dead on. And um, then you just repower it and keep going. Store. Forward scout. All right, they're running from the start. They got borders and they're not gonna board because they got Zoltan shield. They have this really disgusting missile, which is five power deep. That's uh, not good. Do six damage. That's sort of unlikely here. Uh, it's currently in storage because I thought I would be able to get some crew kills with a firebomb. I needed hack way earlier than that. It's four shields. Okay, dodge, 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 dodge. Okay, so halberd through here, whole beam through here. Mind control shields, so I actually pull the pilot. Two more damage to their weapons. Oh, so you don't shut the shields then? That doesn't seem like that should be correct. Good dodge. Um, I mean, I guess we could go to the st if there's a beam weapon here, then we just one shot. There's no beam weapon. There's no beam weapon. Should probably do that versus getting another weapon online. It's probably more responsible. You find the source of the distress call. Uh-oh, it's a free augment. Small research station appears a small laboratory fire got out of small control and is threatening to destroy the small station. Their, false, their small fire suppression system is not small responding. Reconstructive teleporter. Wow, that's a lot of money. Oh, well. Bye. One, 
to. Get a reactor. Sigma, welcome on board. Alright, did it. Alright, got at least one mantis there. Yeah, 35 scratch is down. Just like, yeah, whatever, Chuck. Doesn't really matter. Now downloading the data stores. This fight is super easy. Time to shine, Gestro. Get the dodge two shots. Two whole shots. Oh, we got the four. Nice. Didn't. Good job. Good job. Heck yeah, I'll go to distress. What do you need? You need me to take five free damage? Huh? Huh? Trap. Oh. Okay. Um. Three, four, five, six. It's possible, but I do get through piloting. Okay. So it means the heavy laser is definitely gonna hit. So that's. Five damage, three, four, five, plus cloaking another, yeah, whatever. Okay, it's a Leto. Ah, uh, so three damage is currently incoming, we'll try to dodge it. <laughs> nice, cool. Hope you enjoyed it. All the jokes. You didn't, you didn't dodge like anything. So I'm gonna get fixed for a while. Can we woke up here in the new lunch version? Uh, good job. How could you manage to do that? Do I need to? No, I can just do this and win. Let's do that and win. Okay. Oh, right, 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 right. Okay. Yes. Good. Good. Of course, that really, like, puts my chances of picking up a beam weapon then. Uh, reject. So because they're not actually, we don't see like a picture of a crew here, we know this is just garbage. Execute them on the spot. It's a bug. It's a funny bug. All right, so see, here's the same thing, because uh, somebody asked. So it, it just fired. So we just turned it off. And we hear that it just completely whiffed. Boom. Yeah, that's what I was doing, hacking. Uh, I'm not dealing with whatever the shenanigans are incoming right now, so I really don't have to. Um, am I just killing them? Yeah, I guess.
No store? That's impossible. Yeah, so we're just doing this all the time. Weapons are definitely spooky. So that's two damage, that's three damage, which may only take that weapon offline. I'd have to do another one. Firebomb in here, and more likely to land with this mind control. All right, so you know they're having problems. Hey, of course, there's a, there's a friend. You know who's gonna help you? Faith. That's what we're gonna do. Uh, probably don't need firebomb again, so let's try and get, I don't know, dodge train? Okay, zero dodges. Good job, squad. You did it. A1. Having a bad time over there. They came back. Of course, they grab uh, hungers for more. See the pilot and firebomb in here. <laughs> oh no. All right, and where's my mind control here? Let's run through that. Okay, give them back control. I want them to move into shields. So I depower our, our MC ourself. Yeah, realizing this this was a mistake. Okay, and then just opted to make another mistake. Hey, it's Ryan. Hello, Ryan. All right, everybody who wants has to be on board. Uh, I got Faith on board, I got Gestro on board, I got Core Sigma, so I need another Mantis Get Badger on board. That apparently is not gonna happen. Sorry. Uh, approach the station. Is definitely offline. So we're doing five damage to their weapon system. Should be safe. I should kind of hold on, hope to like getting a one shot just makes everything so much easier. We don't like need it, of course. jump out of the sector. That's good. Yeah, that's what it all it did. Uh, scrap it. Scrap it out. Uh, 
All right, uh, you arrive at an outpost close to the Federation base. Your access codes get you past the security, and an officer sets up a direct feed to the Federation base's war room. Admiral Tully speaks first, saying, What is the meaning of this? Who are you? How did you get here? Where are my pants? Explain your mission. Your explanation is met with murmurs of cynicism and disbelief among the officers. Every time. General Churzel of the NG Brigade speaks up. Intel suggests potential counter to rebel technology. Risk all or save none. How did I get here in two hours? Yeah, I guess, like what, the the NG sectors where we didn't have fights and that we one-shotted everything with Albert Beams is kind of fast. Like we wouldn't do, we did like no crew killing whatsoever. Uh, explain the weakness of the enemy fleet. It is the rebel flagship. Small totally responds. It's settled. The small rebels will be here in a matter of small moments. We'll do what we can to hold off their small warships, but you must succeed in destroying this small flagship. Your current outpost can provide some repairs and fuel, and other small repair stations can provide aid as well. Good luck. Good luck. Repair. Base. Uh, okay. Small totally. Store? No. Okay, so that alone just makes us safe. Right? Yes. And this just makes things a little bit more interesting. Words are the words, and the words are the words. Words are words, you can't words in the word of words, words. Yep, yep, those are just, that's just facts right there. Ooh, they got that fixed real fast, but they're pretty badly desynced. It's looking uh, pretty okay right now. I have 45 missiles. Got our training. money not a store but money doesn't reach, does it? I gotta be that way. 
Yeah, three damage just isn't enough. And they get like minus three. That, that's still a pretty massive decline in piloting for them. Oh, that feels so bad. Whenever the firebomb only starts one fire. Like in a two by two room. You're like, come on. Here is your time to shine. There you go, see? That's way better. Store? <gasps> One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, we can get there. All right, store's interesting. Okay. Just go into an oxygenless environment. Good. Excellent choices. They might get out. Beam me. Oh, oh, we can do it. Awesome. Oh, this is so good. Chat, this is so good. Yep, don't need you. Get out of here. Nobody loves you. Um, yep. 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 Where are you? Where are you? North? North, huh? Ryan? Uh, bye, Ryan. Oh, fully trained? That's a badger. That is a badger if I ever saw one. Yeah, blame Badger. There we go. I like how that turned out for me. Uh, yeah, I guess I'll still with the stealth weapons. It's fine. This is good. This is good. Do I need anything else? Um, sure. No, no. A little bit more money would be great. No, I'm totally fighting this ship. Uh-huh, you have a ship. I have one too. Let's see who wins. Oh, you have hacking. All right, that's fair. Should probably pay attention to that. That's so good. Okay. Um, I really want the pipe beam to go this way, though. Yep, yeah, good fight. Contact the survivors. Gratitude. Two reactor upgrades. Oh, I should have got level three cloaking. Should have just got level three cloaking. Can you give me 50 scrap, please? Ship that can't actually hurt me. Oh, I got rid of my firebomb. Oh no, what have I done? I got rid of the firebomb. Gonna have to use uh, the heavy laser for the crew kill then. Boo. 
is that? What the heck do you mean it didn't start a fire? Intruder? Where the heck did that thing come from? Did he get shot down or something at some point? Alright, well, whatever. We got this. We got this. <laughs> we got this. Not sure if that's just death. 29 scrap. Three jumps. One, two, and three. Yeah, I thought the Sultan Shield had been down for a while, but I guess not. I'm not particularly paying attention for some reason. Alright, we'll get enough money after. Was it 20 scrap? Yeah. Yeah, it's true. Uh, we just run from these fights, by the way. Though, no, seriously, nice weapon setups. We're just buying time for, uh, it's plenty of fun. That is correct. I'm just waiting for stuff to come off cooldown. It's good enough. I don't want anybody to board my ship. All right, this is it, the Rogue Flagship. If you're able to destroy this monstrosity, the Federation fleet will have a chance of surviving. There's no turning back. All right, good luck, everyone. is eight that is five this is nine Couldn't just let me enjoy the runs. No 69s the entire time. Everybody, we were just having a good fun time. Ruins it right at the end. <sighs> Chase down the small flagship by staying right where you were and discover it is heavily damaged from the previous fight. Scans and gates redirected considerable power to its drones. Get ready for a fight. Nine. 
want that thing even boarding my ship. GG's. Uh oh. I think my heavy laser hit something. Thirty bucks. Uh, reactor. Right, I don't need any of those things right now. Like it. You're not certain how it's able to keep fighting with the amount of damage it's sustained. It looks like a strand for power to the teleport as well as some kind of super weapon. Be prepared, this is it. Control, heavy laser, super not necessary. That and uh, this. GG's. Bing! Called it. Uh, thank you, Unlucky Unreal, Angerman, Gestro, Faith, Corsing, and Badger for uh, joining the crew. Zoltan A. Yeah, like it was. <sighs> the only challenging part of the run was just the stupid store locations were so absurd for like the first five sectors. <laughs> 319? Wow, rude. Yeah, I mean, I don't know. We didn't kill like a whole bunch of shit. Oh no, Game Punker, why rating? We're we're done. We, we it's over. We won. Thanks for the host. Yeah, that was a quick one. I mean, again, we were pretty much killing things in two volleys. We didn't have to do any crew kills whatsoever, and then we just like one shot at the flagship. So. Dillazine girl, thank you. All right, 5641. New run. Well, the problem is, 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 isn't that this one was fast, is that the next one could be so much long, could be like, could be like a five hour run. And then it's like, oh, it's like eight o'clock in the morning and my brain is melting. That's less good for me. 42, 103, the old 1891. 641. Eight no. You be badger, congratulations. That's that's the real goal. Got everybody on board though, so that's pretty nice. 56. Yeah, that was just Yeah, I mean what, like I said, just the really bad store placements and we didn't find weapons. When did we buy a weapon? Was it Sector 5 when we finally got off the starting weapons of the, the, of the ship? 